NRC Event Notification Report for January 7, 2013, Open Transport Vehicle with Radiation Levels Exceeding Limits Shipment of 33,250 pounds of nuclear waste of zinc-65 and cobalt-60 arrived at the U.S. Ecology Waste Site on the morning of December 11, 2012. The drums were accelerator targets from GE Healthcare in Illinois and New Jersey, loaded in boxes, which were again loaded in drums and cemented in place. U.S. Ecology staff conducted surveys of the shipping vehicle and reported to Washington State Department of Health that the dose rate on the bottom of the truck was greater than 200 millirem per hour which is 10,000 times normal background level. Washington State Department of Health inspector conducted a more accurate measurement and found that the dose rate was 250 millirem per hour. The shipment shifted in transportation and was not braced to withstand conditions of normal transportation. Upon inspecting the shipment the drums were not tightly contained in the trailer noted by gaps between the tow boards and the drums, loose straps in the rear of the drums, and large spaces between the load locks and the drums. The driver was asked if his trip was normal, without any abnormal stops, turns, stops or bumps, and he said it was a very smooth ride, all on interstate but he picked the load up in Iowa after the first truck had mechanical issues. One large drum could be a rock back and forth a few inches while it was still strapped in the truck. A more detailed inspection of the packages occurred on the December 12th and 13th on the bottom of drums that exhibited higher than manifested dose rates. Two drums were found to have external on-contact dose rates of 1.5 rem per hour or about 100 thousand times normal background. One drum's lid was not correctly installed, one drum could not be correlated to the manifest, as there was a transposition error in the drum number.